Hi, this is David Tierney of Designs by Tierney. I'd like to show you just how easy it is to make an edit, to make a change to a Concrete 5 based website. Now, Concrete 5 is a content management system. That is, for a website, it's a program that allows somebody who is not a programmer to change content on their website. I personally find that Concrete 5 is the, the easiest program to use as far as editing a website and what the reason why I choose it for some of my customers. So let's uh, go to the login page. Generally what you do is you'll be at your website and you'll have to navigate in your website browser to a specific website address where the login page is. For this basic initial installation of Concrete 5 I've got here, there's a link at the bottom of the page it allows me to sign in. So I click on here and it takes me to the login page where I enter in a username and a password. I've actually just got it saved here. And now I'm logged in. So it takes me right back to the home page which I really like. And now what we're going to do is you can just navigate to the page we want to edit. Let's say we want to edit the about page. So we just go to the about page and the navigation. And uh, let's say we want to change some words here and get rid of this picture that we put in here. So we go up to the edit button. We can either click on the edit or click on the blue button. Same thing. And now this whole page is in edit mode. And wherever we move our cursor, there are these gray boxes. And by clicking on any of these gray boxes, we can edit the content of that gray box. Contact, the contact form is a, is, a, is a box that can be edited just like anything else. So. Let's say we're going to edit some content. We're going to click on the box once, and that gives us some options. And to edit content, we click on the Edit option, and it opens up a What You See Is What You Get text editor with buttons like bolding and italicized and underlined and formatting left and right. You can change font size, uh, many other things. Add images, add files, insert links. So let's say we want to just uh, make this ominous uppercase. Highlight it, edit it. Want to make it bold. Um, let's say we want to get rid of this image. We just click on it and then hit the delete button. It's gone. Maybe we want to make this into a second paragraph. Just like if you were using a word processor like Microsoft Word and that's all there is to it. Click Save. Changes are made. Go up here to our edit. We can either click to discard the edits if you did something that you didn't want to do or you can preview your edits, or you hit the blue button to publish your edits. Once you publish it, it's live. There are your changes. It's that simple. Go ahead and sign out. Go to our About page, and that's it.